guys, welcome back. It's time for SmackDown in uh, Des Moines, Iowa. There we are. Uh, so what we're gonna do? We got a main event hype it, right? We got an advertise promo. Uh, match five, take team. Uh, we're gonna give it's a six man. Can we do it? So now what I want, I want a six man. No. There we go. Triple threat to enable tag. It's gonna be so Ben Grenier, Rene Dupree, Rey Mysterio, and Shawn Michaels. I starting here against Kane in the Big Show. Putting the tag team titles on the line. All right, we kind of have to. Cruiserweight title is going to be single, no manager. Hurricane with Trish. Against Chavo. I kind of need to move this to here. Can be just a single, no manager. Tista versus Cena. Not for the title. This is where that table match comes into place. Triple threat tornado tag. Alright, let's go. Sean and Ray. Sylvain Grenier. Rene Dupree get a title shot against Kane in this sh big show. So that's keeping that rivalry going against Kane, Big Show, Ray, and Mysterio. They're adding in that third team. Tag team titles. It's gonna be a prove yourself match between Doug and Danny. Hopefully this doesn't start a rivalry between these two, which I really hope it doesn't. And yeah, then we're gonna go all out here. Hell in a Cell, Fatal 4-Way, Rob Van Dam, Christian, Carlito and William Regal for the United States title. Because I, I mean, I don't know what else to do here. We've been losing fans four or five weeks in a row now. That's four weeks in a row that we've lost fans. Getting ready for a pay-per-view. It's not desperation time, but it's starting to be desperation time, and we're losing to the computer. We're not even playing anybody. I think if we were playing somebody, we'd be doing a little bit better, but it is what it is. So, Batista and Cena, their rivalry is going to send you. Undertaker and Flair, their rivalry is going to send you. we got to do something to get Flair a oh, victory over Undertaker. Uh, you got the triple threat. Big Show Kane, Rey Mysterio, Sean, 
Sylvain Garnier and Rene Dupree. A Fatal 4 way for the United States Championship. And Helena Cell. Main event height. Doug and Danny, and then just a prove yourself match. And then the Cruiserweight title single with hopefully trying to get Hurricane that title back. And. Walk everything into place, and we'll simulate. Hurricane wins. That's good. Hurricane. Hurricane's back to being the Cruiserweight title, which is good. Uh, kind of what I want to do. And then at the pay per view, have that blow off feud blow off match. Doug and Danny. Uh, Danny proved that he's a little bit better of the brothers. Rob Van Dam wins his wins the title. Wins the United States Championship. So that's the new title holder right there. Which is good. Uh, now all four men have won it. Which is going to continue this storyline even further. And this is not what I wanted to happen at all. Not <laughs> what I wanted. Oh, no, 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 and Ric Flair gets a victory. So hopefully that makes him happy in the main event. Ric Flair gets a victory over Undertaker. Not to mention that they still, this is gonna be a match right here, Batista, Cena, Undertaker, and Flair at the pay-per-view at Judgment Day coming up. So we'll see how things go. We'll continue and see if we win some fans. Please say fan change, SmackDown. Fan change, SmackDown. 140,000. Okay, okay. Rey Mysterio can't buy a victory. Yeah, we know. Uh, Raw rating was two after the pay-per-view, so that's not good. And we were two and a half, so the new champion is Rob Van Dam. Can't buy a victory. Kurt Angle is the main event. Great match enjoyed by all, which was John Cena and Batista. Sleeper match excited the fans, which was Ric Flair. And Randy Orton prevailed, so... Let's look at these emails. Superstar specialties, yeah, we don't need to worry about that right now. Fuel roster, any fatigue coming in. Carlito, so Regal's on content now, or is content. Remister is unsatisfied. So I think I know what I'm gonna do with that. We're gonna probably break up one of the rivalries and throw Mysterio in the cruiserweight title shots or contention for next week. He's can, he needs a victory. He can't. All right. He's unsatisfied. Loss after loss really hurts. He wants morale. How about a little GM intervention? What do you want me to do, man? You've lost five weeks in a row in five matches. Jeez. He had a championship match, so we'll see. Uh, content, though, I think, is Regal. And it's because he keeps losing. Been on a losing streak. Been losing every week. We're not losing streak, so yes. So we'll see. Fatigue's not terrible. We got a couple of weeks. So we'll take it easy for a little bit. I think before we get into anything, Tori can get signed again for another five weeks. We got a lot of people to start signing here. Um, who do we want? I want to bring back Kane, put him out of three months. Put show on three months. We're gonna have too much money. Rey Mysterio is gonna get brought back for six. I know he's unsatisfied, but hopefully we can change that. Sean, put him in six months. And then we'll start looking at everybody once after the pay-per-view. And after we get some money back, um, let's look at these rivalries. Undertaker, Sean, still one. Kane and Ray one. Sean and Show are one. Chavo and Hurricane are one. Cena and Batista are one. And then Doug and Danny, which that's just, that's probably going to continue. Just because we're going to put them in a feud with Sylvain and Renee. 
Champions look like this. John Cena, Sylvain Garnier, Rene Dupree, Rob Van Dam, and the Hurricane. We don't have any injuries. We're not really worried about that too much. Reports, we can go look. Let's go look at how it went. Ooh, one star match. Yeah, I kind of figured that. That should have been the opener. But Chavo and the Hurricane, they're starting to get there. Two and a half for the United States. Hell in a Cell, Fatal 4-Way. I feel like that should have been like at least a three star match. Another two and a half there with the triple threat tag teams. A three and a half star match between Batista and John Cena and then Undertaker and Flair. So we won this, but really terrible put together. And they even had a perfectly built show. It's just nothing. Triple H still can't buy a victory. So I wonder if we could trade for Triple H. Can we do that? Because he's not happy over there. Says he's happy, but he's really not. I wonder what it would take to get Triple H. Because uh, I don't even know where I'd put him in. In here, I'd give you guys Rey Mysterio. Let's see what they say. Trade declined. Yeah. Figure as much. Figure that would happen. All right. We have what? We have one, two. We have three weeks before Judgment Day, and then we have a pay per view right after. So, next week, we're in Orangeburg, South Carolina. So, come back next week as we get ready to steamroll Raw and get our fans back before they have their pay-per-view of Vengeance. Then we get the Great American Bash. Then we go into SummerSlam. So, we're on the road to SummerSlam. Not really. We're really on the road to Judgment Day here. So, come back uh, next week. For Orangeboro, South Carolina. Alright, y'all. Peace.